Well, at least they didn't make us wait for a 35-minute episode every week. This show's no daredevil, but I still found some fun out of it. Taking place after Hawkeye, Maya must choose between connecting with a Native American roots or Kingpin himself. This show's I. I was hoping for it to be more standalone and darker, but I guess they just can't stay away from the MCU. The show tries to lean towards grittier territories, but I still feel like it is holding back. It still feels very MCU-esque, which is a disappointment. The grittier scenes are basically all shown in the trailer. Some scenes also whiz by too fast, not allowing the shock factor to really sink in. What I like about the show is Maya's mental battle as she tries to choose which side is her true family, and how Kingpin knows this weakness and uses it to manipulate her. There are also some really well crafted action scenes that feel very chaotic yet well choreographed and do not feel too overwhelming. Everything was fine until the final episode. The final episode is pretty terrible. Dialogues feel forced. You get these cringe worthy lines like, my family runs in my blood. They're part of me. One second ago, Maya was battling which side to choose. Then she suddenly blurts out that line. Terrible. Then we have the last five minutes. Like what on earth is that? Literally the most random and sudden ending I've seen in the show. That alone made me deduct one point for the show. Echo was fine. That ending though? What? What? What the hell is even that?